I wanted to share this really simple example of one of the new tools that I've been putting into my rigging tools add-on. Here I've got one of the uh, animal rigs from the Rigify uh, add-on that comes with Blender. Deleted a bunch of the bones so that really all I'm left with is, is just a quadruped skeleton. And then I've added some IK constraints to the feet and the tail. So far, nothing too special. Now here I went through and I added a plane just kind of overlapping each one of the uh, main bones in this armature. And if I wanted to parent these each to one of the bones, I would need to, uh, in the bone, I would need to select one of the bones, come out, select the mesh, select the mesh, select the uh, armature, parent, and choose bone. And then that one mesh would be parented to that bone. Undo that. And I'm going to go ahead and select all of this and have the armature be my active selection. And then you'll see up here in my rigging tools, parent meshes to bones. Actually, I've got a typo there. Um, that should say parent meshes, not meshed, but it still works. So I'm going to click this button. I want to take the average position of the objects and compare them to the center of each bone. Uh, only use bones that are marked as deformed and uh, don't replace the parenting if a uh, object already has a parent that I've selected. I'll click OK. Now if I go into pose mode, you'll see that all of these bones are now parents of the meshes. And if one of them did happen to get associated to the wrong bone, I could simply I could simply select my armature, then select one of the meshes. And here we can see that uh, the parent bone of this mesh plane is the meta rig uh, with the bone of spine.006. And I could say change parent bone, and it will show me all of the bones here. And maybe I want this to be associated to the face bone instead. Uh, I would simply come here, choose face, click OK. And now that's associated to the, a different bone. So for those of you who are concerned that I was only adding features for parenting vertices to bone groups, uh, these are some of the things that I'm working on for parenting objects directly to bones. So, so I just thought I'd share that. The link to get the extension is in the description. Uh, you can find out more about it there. Thanks for watching.